Chapter 6 Welcome back, everyone. We are continuing the story of Jin Hyuk, whose favorite game turned into reality, and he is using his game knowledge to get super strong as soon as possible. If you haven't watched the previous part, the link is in the description. Let's continue the story. But before the spear could reach its target, Kwang! Jin Hyuk punched aside the flying javelin with his fist. The spear spun in the air and fell harmlessly to the ground. Insane! What did he just do? He just knocked that spear out of the way. No. But how does this make sense? He didn't avoid it but hit it instead? He hit a spear made of steel. Wouldn't it be normal if his fist got crushed instead? The people watching were all shocked. I don't know how good my stats are right now, so I had no choice but to react like that. What are you gonna do now? Looks like your dog's only weapon is gone? Jin Hyuk shrugged while looking at Lee Yuri. Who... Who said there is just one statue? Li Yuri pulled four more statues from her bag. Holy Relic Incarnation of Anubis replica is manifesting. Kukukuku. Four more so-called incarnations of Anubis appeared. They were armed with a sword, shield, spear, mace, and halberd, and had their teeth bared. So? Think you can still joke around? Li Yuri wore a smile as she showed off all her cards. Very good. I am quite surprised. Considering that it was tough to maintain control over the magic when summoning just one, being able to summon five wasn't an easy feat. Even the old man with his magic was exceptional. Surprisingly, there seemed to be skilled people around. Hmm, quite surprised? Li Yuri's eyes twitched at those words. Right. Exactly between quite surprised and a little surprised. Don't act pretentious with me. I know that anyone would want to run away now. You think so? Actually, that was just what any normal person would see. Then. Let's show her my card now. Let them judge if this was a lie or not. Jin Hyuk opened the paper in his hand. Magic has been infused into the sacred relic of Pine and Tiger. Replica. The ruler of mountains appears. All that was known was that it was the most feared being of a certain era. Please hit the like button so more people can enjoy this awesome story and subscribe to the channel for more videos. Now let's get back to the story. A tiger manifested itself from the piece of paper and roared loudly. The air shook with the sound of its roar. Roar! It was at least three meters tall, and its muscles rippled as it moved. An indescribable feeling of intimidation shone from its bright yellow eyes. No way. Li Yuri bit her lips. It wasn't just materializing, but he made the original appear. The painting depicted the power of the tiger that ruled over the mountain in a long past era. The entirety of the feeling of that power is reproduced. Five to one. No success. There is no such thing as a desert jackal attacking a mountain lion. Jin Hyuk stroked the tiger on its head. Eat them up. Quack! A giant monster was smashed to the ground as the distance between the tiger and the jackals narrowed. Tear. The bodies of the jackals were torn apart like paper. Truly an overwhelming force. Ike! Like ants climbing the back of a dinosaur, all five incarnations of Anubis were destroyed without even being able to fight back. Tremble. Li Yuri's body continued to tremble. T this cannot be. My summons was helpless. This was absurd. She had been sure that she was the strongest here. She thought it would be a matter of course that she would get the map too. Why? She wasn't sure where that confidence had come from either. W will you kill me? I have no interest in killing scared newbies. Give me the mask of Tutankhamun. At his words, her eyes widened. It is useless in Korea. Where are you going to use it? You don't have to know it. If you don't want to enter the belly of a tiger, give it to me. Jin Hyuk glanced at the tiger next to him. Grrr. It had chewed up the jackals and came to them with blood still around its lips. She was afraid that the tiger would haunt her dreams that night. I... We'll give it to you. I will give it. Reluctantly, Li Yuri pulled out the mask from within her bag. It was a pharaoh's mask made in gold. You have acquired the relic, replica, mask of Tutankhamun. Nice. Following the relic he had obtained from the museum's first floor before coming here, this was now the second that he had secured. Are you also after the map? Map? Right. That was in here. He didn't pay much attention to it, so he forgot. Jin Hyuk smiled and patted the tiger on the back for the last time. Guard this place. Let no one follow me. 
Ruar. The tiger guarded the entrance of the stairway to the next floor. Then, let's go and get the strongest skill in the Tower of Trials. Jin Hyuk walked up the stairs and went to the next floor. With that, the chapter ends here. What is going to happen next? What skill is he talking about? How is he planning to fight the Fire Mage? To get all the answers, please like and subscribe to the channel. I will be posting the next part soon.